Good morning, everyone. It is 839 right now. Welcome back to Iowa Live. Lou and Jackie here. And boy, oh boy, just getting ready for some more outstanding events going on this weekend. And we love it when it includes food. And how about some incredible barbecue? A little smoke on the water. Mm. We're talking to <laughs> President Jeff Arment this morning to talk about we are bringing amazing people, incredible food together for a wonderful cause. It is. And this is our sixth year of having this event. It, it kind of started... A dear friend of mine had brain cancer, and I was kind of doing meals for the family. Okay. And, you know, we thought, why not make this kind of an annual fundraiser thing? So we started the smoke in the water for him, and then it's just evolved. How many, from there. Sense, How many yeah. different people got together for the first time you, you got this uh, put together? I think the first event we had six. Okay. Uh, to community members, friends coming together for a good cause. Yep. But since then has expanded in a huge way, sir. It, it has. Um, we've drawn teams from all across Iowa. And we've limited it to 29 teams now. And uh, the day of the event, we'll see close to a thousand people there. Wow. Seriously, that many? That's amazing. For okay. The small town of Linville. I was gonna say, so we're talking smoke on the water. So that means where are we located? Linville, Iowa, at Old Settlers Ground. Okay. okay. And how far is that from Des Moines? It's about an hour drive. Okay. But, but well, it's a worth beautiful it. park. Lots of shade trees fun activities all day long. Follow the uh, smell of smoke. Absolutely. There you go. Speaking of activities, <laughs> let's start running down some of the things that you can expect going on. Okay. Okay. Um, we'll have a kid's queue where anybody, anybody's children come and actually we'll provide hamburgers, we'll provide a grill, and they can, you know, put out their best product, trophies for the kids. It's, it's kind of a fun thing to watch them. Getting them cooking young, huh? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Oh, I love that. Um, from one to three, we'll have a bluegrass, just an open jam. People just come and pick and sing, and it's it's really fun. And, and a lot of people come out and just sit around and actually just watch them. Yeah, a little entertainment. Yep. Uh, one o'clock will be the Kids Q Awards. We'll tell everybody, you know, who won and stuff like that. And then the meat category, the team, we have 27 teams from across Iowa. We're an Iowa Barbecue Society sanctioned event. Okay. And these teams will be turning in their meats, um, starting with chicken at two o'clock, ribs at 2.30, pork butts at three, and brisket at four. Uh, most importantly, sir, um, are we able to taste this amazing uh, barbecue? Absolutely. Okay, right. good. <laughs> Absolutely, at four, four to 4.30, we'll have the public. Um, we ask for a minimum of a $5 donation the people can come, taste everybody's competition food. Um, we'll have a people's choice, which this year the theme is anything cheese. So the teams can cook whatever they want as long as it includes cheese. And the people actually vote for who they think has the best side dish. So okay. has anybody ever gone the, and done the entire uh, the circle? or No. No cycle? No. Myself. I've thrown out a $100 bill challenge to anyone that can go sample everybody's meat and finish it right there in the spot. No taking it home. <laughs> <laughs> you have to finish it right there, and nobody's been able to do it. Yeah. That tells you how That's much food impressive. is out there. That is very, it very is. impressive. It is. As you can see, there's uh, uh, awards uh, being handed out there, some checks, but there's also a, an auction that happens, happens as well. Yes, we've had a lot of people and companies donate stuff to us. It's a smaller option, auction, but um, we've got one of the best auctioneers in the state of Iowa, Stan McGrath, McGrath Auctioneering. Um, he does a phenomenal job. Um, and it's, it's, it's fun to see all the people come, get involved, raise money, because anything that we raise throughout the year or at this auction goes towards the beneficiary. I was going to okay. say, so who does this go to? Because I know you did it in honor of your wonderful friend. Yep. Uh, where does that money go now? This year, it's for uh, uh, Randy Taylor. Okay. He had a massive heart attack, had to have open heart surgery. And um, so we've been ra raising money, donations, mm -hmm. things like that for him. And like I said, anything that we raise goes right back to the beneficiary. And people can uh, be, uh, know that this is a 501c nonprofit organization, Correct. right? So the, 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 all the money is going to go where it needs to go. Absolutely. At the end of the year, the only thing we keep back is enough to get us started next year. Why do you think I this is it. so successful? Why do you think people have uh, gravitated toward this event? I, I think it's because of the community that we live in. 
Um, it's fun to see our community come out. I mean, from Linville, Sully, Reasoner, Grinnell. I mean, all the air, local areas around mm -hmm. us come and really have a good time and and help somebody in in need because that's what our 513C status is. Someone going through a medical hardship. And okay. you're there stepping up and, and doing it. We're there to try and help them ease it a little bit. Now, did you start off by competing? I did. Okay. I Are did. you still competing? I am. No, I am not. Um, I started Linville Smoke and Jays Barbecue, and that's what I do now for a living. Okay. And so I didn't think it was right for me to be. I mean, I cook every day. He, he didn't want to smoke the competition, no, so to speak. No, no, no. There's plenty of teams that would be <laughs> Now, me, can, sure. can a professional organization get involved in the competition, or are these, are these amateurs? It, it's Backyard Series for the Iowa Barbecue Society. Backyard, so it's, okay. Got it's, it. You know, yeah. It's for the local guys. We don't really want the professionals coming and, and handing it to them. So maybe some people are just getting started out, and they, they want to get their feet wet yep. in, in a competition. This would be a great one this to start off with, isn't perfect it? perfect for them. Which one seems, which category of meat seems to be the most popular? Brisket by far. Brisket by far. Uh, I'd mm -hmm. have to agree with that. That's mm -hmm. usually my favorite, mm -hmm. too. Uh, so let's give everybody the details, because it sounds like you're jam-packed for the one coming up this weekend, but maybe people are looking forward to next year or want to get involved and want to help out. But yeah. this weekend, where do we need to go and when to be a part of it? We need to have people come to Linville, and we'll have signs posted. Every entry into Linville, we'll have signs posted directing where to go, okay. how to get to Old Settlers Grounds. It's really, really easy to get there. Okay. Uh, it's a huge park. Um, we'll have, there's some teams that are bringing campers to camp. Mm -hmm. um, we've got plenty of things throughout the day, events for people do. There's a huge playground for kids. So it's, it's kid friendly, uh, family friendly. Now tell everybody when the event is. It is this Saturday, August 25th or 24th. Mm -hmm. um, at Old Settlers Grounds, and we we hope everybody comes. Yeah, people will be cooking mm -hmm. early, but uh, if you want to start enjoying the part I enjoy, which is taste testing, uh, that's going to be happening around 4 o'clock in the afternoon. 4 o'clock, yes. Okay. Yep. Uh, head to the Facebook page, uh, Smoke on the Water. You will see some incredible photos and really see what this organization is all about and where to go and how to be a part of something so wonderful, how you're bringing good food, good people together for a great cause. That's absolutely that, wonderful. That is actually our motto. Boom! <laughs> that is our see, motto. See, everything works together. It does. It, it does. And what you're doing is outstanding. And, and the song is playing nonstop in the background, right? We, yeah, okay. we actually have a band playing Saturday night, actually a couple bands, the local uh, high school boys are going to play, and, and they're learning Smoke on the Water. They style. better learn Smoke on the Water, yeah. So, yeah, we'll hear it a couple, two or three times throughout the day. That's awesome. Thank you so much Thank for you. doing what you're doing, and Thank we you. wish you the very best in success and raise a whole bunch of money. Thank you. Yeah. Thank idea. you for being here today. Yep. Thank All you. Right. It